Hey guys, it's the Soul Clock Theme today, and so this Monster Analysis video, we're going to be going over Gravitron. I'm going to be telling you guys whether or not Gravitron is worth getting out of his current breeding event. So let's one, get right into it. All right, so Gravitron is a support, and his traits are stun immunity, bleed immunity, and team random positive. Those are just kind of bad traits. And then his relics are amulet and banner, which are actually really good relics. So yeah, bad traits, but at least decent relics, which is cool. So if we go on down to his pros and cons, he has access to some nice team protections, which is pretty cool. He also has access to NER, which is really cool. He also has a low cooldowns, good relics, great speed, and trait status caster is really good. But honestly, it's not super amazing. But you could get something good, I guess. It is random, though. And then his cons are no PR as a support outside of his ult. He also has elemental protections, which are situational. And he has a bad trait besides status caster, and he's got high stamina cost, which is true. So now let's go on down to his moveset. So he has an ally NER with metal protection, which is okay, I guess. He also has an AoE team NER, which is actually pretty good. So he has an ally NER with metal protection, which is okay, I guess. He also has an AoE team NER, which is actually pretty good. So he has an ally NER with metal protection, which is okay, I guess. He also has an AoE team NER, which is actually pretty good. So he has an ally NER with metal protection, which is okay, I guess. He also has an AoE team NER, which is actually pretty good. He has a team random protection with earth protection and metal protection, which is all right. And then he has a team trait protection, which is just kind of bad, honestly. So yeah, overall, this monster seems all right he's just not very good he is in a breeding event though so still go ahead and try to get him because of course he is free to play out of a breeding event but yeah his moves are not super good i probably wouldn't use him on your team there's just so many monsters that do what he does but do it better even like in the breeding event going on right now there are better monsters than him so yeah just keep that in mind when getting a gravitron he's just not super great but he's all right he could be used in like wars if you don't have any monsters of his element or in his books that could always be a good spot for him but yeah i wouldn't use him on your normal multiplayer team or anything like that because he's just not that good but yeah let me know down in the comments what you guys think of gravitron if you guys are going to be getting him out of the breeding event and i'll see you guys in the next one don't forget to like share and subscribe goodbye